Happy New, New Year. Year! Hello and welcome back to Flora and the Novice Explorers. It is the new year, but this message and video is slightly belated because it's about the 15th or 16th of January. Not very prompt, but we're not anymore. It is our first video of the year. We do apologise for that. It's just been a bit of a whirlwind. Strange times. In a way, not much has happened. And then in other ways, a lot has happened. Yes, indeed. Yeah. We wanted to give you a little bit of an update as to where we are, where we are, what we're doing and what's new. So, if you saw our last video, we're very much still in the caravan. Uh, we've experienced some more of the harsher weather <laughs> when we recorded that video. Things have been alright weather-wise, haven't they? Yeah. But then uh, the temperature took a dip, we had a lot of snow, a lot of rain and a lot of freezing cold mornings. So uh, we were getting used to that side of things. Minus seven it was the one day. Yeah, yes. one morning, big time. It hasn't been too bad though. No. We've, we've made it work for us. But yeah, that's where we are. Um, in relation to the lockdown, I am still working. Yeah, I'm not. Since we went into tier three, it meant that all the pubs and cafes and stuff closed. So I am furlough, doing a little bit of takeaway on the weekend. It's good, to, you know, it gives us a chance to save a little bit of money for future adventures whenever they might occur. Um, you know, we were hoping to get away like this spring, but this was going back a few months. This was our plan to maybe by back in March, April, we'll be on the road again, and that just is not going to happen. Nope. Um, I don't even know how much we'll be able to do this year, but we'll stay positive and just see what happens. So what you're really here for, it's a new year and we've got a new tiny weeny little explorer to show you. Welcome to the team, Rufus! <laughs> so this is the newest member of the team, Rufus. He's a 12 week old, don't bite the microphones. <laughs> Jack Russell Terrier. Hey, you naughty boy. <laughs> <laughs> You're meant to be really well behaved on the camera. You're doing really well earlier. Yes, so he is a black and tan miniature Jack Russell Terrier cross type of thing. This really won't come as a surprise to most of you. You know um, we've got a real love for dogs and you've probably seen him on our social medias if you follow us there. And it was only a matter of time until we did um, find the right dog for us. Yeah, after Doug went home, after we spent about a month and a half with us at least, there was something that was missing <laughs> from our lives after just being with him for a, such a long time really. So he went back home and then I think we slowly made the decision that it was time. And we didn't jump into it lightly. Uh, we know it's a big, you know, undertaking. Commitment. Getting a dog. So we spent a lot of time also researching adoption and actually applying mm. for a few dogs as well. That's the route we wanted to take. Uh, but it soon became quite apparent that that was nigh on impossible due to some of our uh, living circumstances. Yes, as much as we understand why there's so many hoops to jump through, there's a few that we weren't quite achieving. So that led us on to a sort of broader search and that's where we came across little Rufus. He was uh, nine weeks old, ten weeks yeah. old, <laughs> when we saw him and we almost fell in love instantly. I mean, He's got the cutest little face when he's not biting your fingers. Um, <laughs> and the markings on him are quite unique, I think. So with Meg being furloughed and me just working through the week, we've got a lot of time uh, to dedicate to looking after Rufus and making sure he's grown, growing up to be the nice, polite dog that we want him to be. So we're getting on rather well with the training. Here's a little snapshot of how we're getting on. So my name is Meg. <laughs> I already know who I am. <laughs> so for the past two and a half to three weeks, I've been full-time dog trainer, or puppy trainer more to the point. It's going rather well. And I'd like to update you on where we're at and what we've learnt. So within the first week, we learnt sit. Good boy. We then progressed on to <laughs> down, down, good boy, roll over, roll over, good boy, very nice, down, good boy, 
and for my next trick, the puppy will go in his bed. In your bed. Good boy, very nice, very good. Very good. We're looking forward and sort of planning and saving a little bit of money where we can to hopefully do some adventures this year and bring you some new videos as well, hopefully. Oh, it will all be UK based really, won't it? Probably. Um, but that, that also came hand in hand with making the decision to get Rufus as well, knowing that this year is potentially a bit of a write-off for going further afield. Yeah, but um, we definitely still want to. It, it, it's so cliche, but it all feels like a dream now. Yeah. Um, now we've sort of slipped back into normal life, as normal as it can be at the moment. You kind of forget about those months and months of living in the van that's just outside here. Yeah. Um, I look back at all the photos the other day, right from when we set off and went to Wales first, and it was just like, oh, wow, we actually, we did, we did do that. We are going to also work on getting some little upgrades done to Flora. Um, that'll be coming over the next couple of months or so. And another wee update you might have seen if you follow us on social media is that we recently became brand ambassadors for Autoturm Planar diesel heaters. That's the uh, heater that we rock in Flora and have been for years now. Yes, so we've got a very special discount code. You'll find it in the description below. It is Flora5 and that gives you 5% off any purchase through Planar. Yeah, so you can save yourself a little bit of money and it helps support the channel too. Um, yeah, thank yeah. you Planar for offering us this ambassadorship. Yeah. And um, we hope plenty of you guys use the code to get money off. And that code again is Flora5. Lovely. I've got to remember to put it in, otherwise that's going to look weird. Yeah. <laughs> So that is it for us for the time being. Sorry it's been such a long time since we've updated you. We never expected to sort of fall behind so much in the video making process. We thought we'd be back on the road soon, adventuring and all that good stuff. So thank you for sticking with us. We really appreciate the support and hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, there'll be some more Novice Explorer action coming later on this year. Yes. May the adventures continue. We hope you guys are keeping well, keeping safe and keeping sane. And we will see you in a new video as soon as we possibly can. We'll see you later. Look after yourselves. Bye. Wave, Rufus. <laughs> He's sleeping. He can't possibly wave. Uh-oh. He's crashed. It's bedtime. Oh, he likes to nuzzle into my armpit. <laughs>